From sequins to lace, the Bowie twins set trends on the campus of USM. Both Hannah and Jasmine created their own line. We were child, we weren't um, just as privileged as others, but growing up we felt that uh, our mom's income or our income shouldn't reflect how we were dressed that day. And a lot of kids thought we actually um, wore expensive things, but which wasn't true. What we would do is find creative ways of finding clothes, cheaper clothes, and find a creative route of, of just changing it up or reconstructing it. And um, some of the girls or guys actually thought and would ask us where we would get the clothing from. And once we um, responded that uh, we actually made the items, they would ask us to make their clothing. And um, I guess once they caught on, we thought, why not make it a hobby where we make money? Senior Hannah says they started designing and reconstructing clothes at a young age. Vogue is an inspiration for all fashion lovers. So. I guess high fashion is really our thing. That was our initial um, reason for starting the Two-Headed Woman. We wanted to bring high fashion down to Mississippi. Though the two are business partners, Jasmine says the twins face challenges. Sometimes she's uh, not so verbal or expressive with her emotions. Like sometimes she can, she's the type of person that can tell you what's wrong with you, but she won't explain to you. And so through her sewing, that's the kind of secret I've had through her. Like some days, if she sews a certain way, I can tell her emotion. Hannah and Jasmine both will be hosting free do-it-yourself classes this semester at So Select in Hattiesburg, Mississippi. For more information, follow them on Twitter at The Two-Headed Woman. From a piece of fabric to a trendy bow tie, the twins hooked me up today. Reporting in Hattiesburg, I'm La Raven Love.